Hey, good morning, Grace family and friends. Pastor Jay here with your morning encouragement. So if you're like me, you like to get outside. And man, this weather that we've had has been unbelievable. And I've used it not just as an occasion to go out and exercise and run, but to deliberately be out in my neighborhood. I make a number of phone calls any given day, like I'm sure many of you do too. And whenever I have those opportunities, I go outside and I walk my neighborhood to make those calls. Because it not only gives me more exercise, but more importantly, it gives me more opportunity to engage with neighbors and folks who live in my neighborhood. I don't know if you've discovered this, but in my neighborhood, there are more people out and about than I've ever seen before. In fact, there is this attitude, this willingness in this season that we find ourselves in with sheltering in place for people to engage and have conversations in ways that they never have before. In fact, I'm finding that people are more friendly and more willing to just stop and talk than I've ever experienced. And because of that, I'm meeting neighbors and engaging with neighbors who I've never talked to before. By way of example, just the other day, just after finishing a phone call, I'm walking not five houses from my home, where here are some neighbors who have lived here for five years who I have never met or talked with personally because I've just simply never crossed paths with them. And they were outside and we began to talk together and in five minutes, I had established more relationship than I have in the last five years with them. And it reminds me of what God's word guides us and tells us to do in these kinds of situations. It says it in Ephesians chapter 5, verse 16, and it's repeated again in Colossians 4, verses 5 through 6. And let me read this to you. It says, Be wise in the way you act towards outsiders. Make the most of every opportunity. Let your conversation be always full of grace, seasoned with salt, so that you may know how to answer everyone. And my friends... This is written in the context of telling people about Jesus, about sharing the gospel. So this is my encouragement to you, is to pray for and ask for the opportunity to tell someone about Jesus and then to look for that opportunity. And then when that opportunity presents itself, to take advantage of it, to act on it, to make the most of it. And I can almost guarantee you that opportunity will come when you're least expecting it when you're probably at the busiest, when you're the least likely to anticipate it, when you don't feel like you have the margins to act on it, when you feel busy, you fill in the blank. But it's not always gonna happen at the most opportune time, but it is an incredible opportunity for you to engage, to build relationship, and yes, to tell someone about Jesus. So I hope that you will do just that. I love you, I miss you, I'm sure looking forward to when we can be together again, and we'll look forward, and I'll look forward to seeing you this Sunday online as we celebrate this amazing God together.